the reason why there is uh, so many jitters when you mention the word handshake is because uh, when Raila and, uh, and Uhuru shook hands, um, you know, the, the, the deputy president then took off and started his early campaigns and, and, and demonized the idea of coming together. You know, some there is nothing better for any country than for leaders to shake hands and agree to work together. Not to join government, and I think this is the underlying part that we need to address. Because media have run quickly and started saying that uh, there are cabinet slots that are being set aside for mm -hmm. members of Azimio. We are not interested in being members of cabinet of the Kenya Kwanzaa regime. And some the reason is this. The difference between Azimio policies and Kenya Kwanzaa policies is like night and day. <laughs> it is light and darkness. We are totally opposed. We are totally opposed in, in, in the way we handle things. The, the punitive taxes that uh, this regime has uh, you know, imp you know, imposed on Kenyans, that is something no one in Azimio would support. So I don't believe that there's any possibility of doing a handshake to work together within government. We can only do a handshake to cool the temper so that they can be given their space to work and we're given our, our space to also oversight them. And they, and they, they secure us as they should and, and give us our space. And, and some, the other reason, of course, there is, uh, we can say there's a little bit of a handshake mm. is because uh, <laughs> the regime has realized that uh, our leader, uh, who is a true Pan-African uh, leader, uh, would his services may be required by the you know the, the, the commission to be able to 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 you know you will actually market Kenya and make Kenya look you know like you, you're uh, saying the regime has they have realized. realized they have realized that they can use our leader the right honorable engineer Raila Amolo Odinga to market Kenya in Africa <laughs> when he becomes so, a you, chair. So you're saying it's not his decision. It is decision, but it is to their interest. Look, who, we of course support him to, be, to become the chair, but who is shouting the loudest? You support him for your own interest? Or we support interest? him because it's good for Africa. But the people who will benefit the most is the regime in power. Because when Kenya is shining because of Raila, then they're the ones who will be taking the credit because That's they're the true. ones who will be doing That's those international true. conferences and saying, you know, our, uh, you know the, the chair, who is our member, who is our citizen. <laughs> So, so, so that's why there's another handshake. But there's no handshake, Sam, for us to go into, into government. That one is not there. So what role would the leader of opposition be dealing, I mean, be, be, be playing, yet you have minority in parliament? No, I, I, I don't know. I, I, I will ask the question just like you. You ask Kenya Kwanza, and I don't know that you can ask Ocheng because o Ocheng is, is a, a Johnny come lately in Kenya Kwanza. Of course, you know one thing. You okay, know, you anyway, I want to have my turn. He's a tradition. Johnny come lately in Kenya Kwanza. He is actually elected as a Mio. So maybe you can ask Senator. <laughs> you know, you, know, you, know you, you said that um, the difference between Azimio and Kenya Kwanza is night and day. Then he campaigned for Azimio. Today he works for Kenya Kwanza. I don't know when it became day. I don't um, know. And, and I he don't believes know in the ideology of Azimio. I understand some issues.